In this video, I'm gonna show y'all the challenges experienced during a youth hunt. Some of the best hunts of y'all life. Y'all have children? Y'all have grandkids? Y'all have nieces and nephews? Y'all need to bring them hunting with y'all before it's too late. We all need to do our part for the future generations of the hunting community. Make sure y'all take them with y'all. Stand called the old box. It's kind of like hunting a ground tent. That's what you look for. Oh, my stomach's turning. I'm gonna have to lay an egg right here by the stand. Well, the tree farmers are cutting the grass. The big grass. The 40, 50 foot tall grass. Big pine trees. That's just part of hunting the pine trees. Some people don't like it when they cut. I like it when they cut. It might not be good that year, but the following years, for about a decade, it makes a property that much better. It's like a giant bed and food plot. Maybe they'll chase up some deer our way. It's funny how they always wait to hunt in season to cut them trees. Don't make no sense. We got homemade deer sticks. Got a stash for breakfast. Good stuff. Fresh out the freezer. What up, everybody? We the deer hunting Cajuns. Y'all watch to the end. Hit the subscribe button. It's gonna be fun. Do it. Do it now. The first visit of the day. We might shoot a crow. <laughs> Just for fun. I don't know if it's gonna come out. They crossed that right away and you ain't got no time. Zoom in. Is it foggy? Yeah, you good. That's a tiny bit of foggy, but I'm good. Give me the white, but... Yeah, okay. I can go all the way to the end of the right away. Yeah, I know. Yeah, the rocks all the time. I saw this in the war movie. You need a juice box. <laughs> stay, on the, stay on the gun. I'm going to get you a juice box and feed it till you throw the straw. It's on safety? Yeah, it's on safety. That's a far shot. Yeah, it's a really far shot. She might come back. They cross that right away we out there. But sometimes they come back where that crow is. Can meet the food plot. Yeah, that's that's a close shot. Yeah. So they starting to move. That's good. Let's put the gun down. That's a four shot. How many crows? Like three. three. Mm -hmm. We saw three deer, they cutting trees across the road that don't seem to phase them. All y'all hunters that get discouraged when they cut trees, ain't tough, that don't bother them deer. I like that sound, they like that sound. They like to come see what kind of equipment they are using. They like the caterpillar equipment, them deer. Oh my gosh, he don't have cell service. What we gonna do? He can't use his bone in the deer stand. Is a rabbit. Is a bunny rabbit. Boy, if it wasn't was illegal to shoot that with your rifle, how you like them rules? Oh, well, you can't shoot a rabbit with a 243. Oh, yeah, that's pretty stupid. It's illegal. It's illegal. <laughs> Cute. Imagine a population in that. That's 
the big Schumacher oak we hunt for bow season. That's some good ones. That's the mm -hmm. ones they like. That's the ones you gotta find. Damn mosquitoes everywhere back here. Let's go. Hunting by the creek. Yeah, it is. 
this game called it. Fruit pot buckets. Alright, we made it to the box. On the way in, they had three doves. They busted us. Yeah. I could have shot one, but it's youth weekend. Yeah. Uh, thought about putting the pattern on the ground with the bag. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. But we wouldn't have had it on camera. Yeah, who cares? We could have filled the box. I have a good feeling something's going to come out with a feed over there. Check it out. That's a food pot we planted. We did some oats, some winter wheat, some rye. Annual rye. That's cereal rye. Alpen rye. Don't buy the rye grass. Useless. This is about a half acre. Put about 200 pounds of triple 13 on it. Had a lime truck that came dump lime on it. I was scared it didn't rain enough, but everything's green. Oh yeah. This little dude don't know what a mosh pit is. I, well, I do know how to strip down the beach shirt. My oh gosh, look, right. he's getting ready for the mosh pit. We used to do that. Take our shirt off and head bang. I feel like I'm at a corn concert watching corn. We going in the mosh pit, kill a deer, we'll put that on the pit. Gentle. It's coming in. Quiet. It's eating. We got time. We got deer. It's a big dog. Loosen it up. Yeah, I wanna shoot. Yeah, I wanna shoot. Yeah, 
filming ain't easy, buddy. Those used to be illegal. You know that. You got a shot? Yeah. He's behind the tree. Oh, I got it. All right. Take your time. Because he ain't Right by the camera. Right. Slow. Just wait. Just wait. He's going to calm down and give you a shot. Come on, dear. Stay in the scope. There you go. Heartfelt. Hmm? You hit him somewhere. I stayed in the scope. I think you got him. You saw it? Yeah, I think you got him. Wait, let's look at this thing. He's got a B shirt. It's right there. Is that the shot? Yeah, right there. Right there. You can see it. That's it. Watch, watch. Look at it good. Yeah. Yeah. Right there in that little pocket. Looked like a hard shot. Yeah. And then you saw his leg. It's that cutting bag. Good cameras. You gotta change the batteries once a month. And we don't see no blood at the shot. We're gonna go on the path he ran and see if we can find him. I was gonna get you one for Christmas for a backup. I guess not. Yeah, he ran in here. Maybe that way. Let's go. I see red berries. I don't see no blood. Well, guys, we don't know what happened, but we don't have a pin drop of blood. We're going to go back and look at the footage. We did a grid search, and there's no blood nowhere, so we'll get it, get it next time. Let's go look at the footage, and maybe we'll come back. If we see something we didn't, uh, we didn't uh, notice on the little camcorder. It hurts when you miss, and you can't find blood, and you don't know if you hit him or if he's still alive. You just hope he's still alive. 
Okay, and there's to be an educated boat that grows big. We had some six inch spikes. It looks like five, six inch long, which is legal, especially for kids in Mississippi. But it just stings. You think your gun's lined up, it could be the guns off. And you could well hit them. Don't know. Shot fell good, he said. On the camera, it looked like he shot good. It's just something that happens. Most of y'all that watched the whole video through knows what that feeling's like. It's unfortunate, but once again, that's why they call it hunting and not killing. He's doing just like his daddy. <laughs> Can't get it together sometimes.